Now, people didn't always realize the importance of wetlands and their benefits to people and wildlife. Let's go back to Della and Rick and learn about the threats to these very special places. Acres of wetlands are being lost each year all over the world. We're here at the Julie Metz Wetland Bank along the Neabsco Creek in Woodbridge, Virginia. Mr. Swanson, please tell us about the threats of the wetlands. Certainly, Della. Threats to wetlands are very, very numerous and all kinds of different threats. Some of those threats include deposition of sediments from development in the upper headwaters of the watershed. You have threats from development under farming and mosquito control where you're alterating or you're amending the flows and the water quality coming into the wetlands. Dredging and stream channelization will have a huge impact on the ability of a wetland to filter water and purify water. Diversions and, and alterations like I was speaking of earlier of flows coming in can really have a huge impact. Development of impervious services, roads, parking lots, all change the different hydrologic channels and what happens to the water as it comes off of that land and goes through that transitional zone into the wetlands. Another big concern is invasive species. Big, big concern for us right here. And then finally, overall, is the effects of climate change. So numerous, numerous threats. I'll give you just a starter list. It's very quiet here, and it's a great place to look for birds and other wildlife. So with all of these threats to the special habitat, it's really important that we do what we can to help conserve wetlands, or maybe even create new ones. Back to you in Canada. Thanks, Stella and Rick. 